Hello everybody, this is Miss Rubin. Welcome to All Women That Are Phenomenal. And again, this is Miss Rubin coming at you. I know, I know, it's been a minute, it's been a minute. Let me take these bangles off. And I'm overdue. Okay, um, this video right here is going to be to Brittany on my Facebook. Brittany. Halsey, Brittany. Can't remember. <laughs> but I know the first name is Brittany. And this um, topic was asked for me to do like three weeks. No, longer than that. Four weeks ago. So let's just get on into it. Um, she basically wanted to know. Um, did I feel it's okay to live in with your boyfriend, like, before you get married, you know, whatnot? Um, my personal opinion is, you know, moral, morally, of course, it, it's, it's like not right, but, um, every, let me see. Every husband that I had, we did live together first. And and because, like, I feel like this. It's like, me, I want to know about them because I'm very picky. And um, you don't want to get with nobody and, and live with them and they, like, you know, not clean. You don't know if their bathroom habits. Um, you don't know their sleep habits. Or any of that you just don't want to do that um, do I think that they would still marry you if you you know if you live together I'm gonna say it like this I did I like I said I lived with them but I didn't give them all of me I didn't I didn't, I didn't do the whole wifey thing you know um, we just live together. I made that perfectly clear. Look, this is what we doing. Um, I, you know, I didn't cook, you know, every day. You know, um, didn't wash. I didn't do none of that kind of stuff. Um, because you don't want to give them like all of you, all, 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 all of you, and y'all just like playing the boyfriend girlfriend role. Now, I'm gonna say if you want to live with this man, then let it be like y'all are at least engaged, you know, um, because you don't want to like, spend all this time with this man and then uh, you playing wifey role and then he don't want to get married, you know what I'm saying, um, and some men, some will do what they have to do not to marry you, you know, just not to get married. Um, if you have been with him and living in the same house, household, um, I'm going to say past like two years, years or whatever, and you not, y'all not even talking about marriage or anything like that, I don't think that's a good way to go or... You might want to sit down with him and look and tell him, like, uh, what are we doing? Are we going to get married? Or unless that's your choice, unless you want to, um, you know, stay in that relationship and not be married, you know, then I say that's you. Um, me personally, I'm not going to spend my whole life with somebody and they, uh, and we're not married, you know, in the same household or whatever. Um, I'm just not going to do that. Um, but you do want to know what you're getting into, you know what I'm saying? Um, just like I'm the type of person that have to have um, two bathrooms. I can't have one bathroom. I have to, you know, I always wanted my 
you know, I have to have my own bathroom, even though I had a, you know, the his and hers and whatever, but I still have to have just my own bathroom. That's what I've been used to. I don't know, you know, and maybe some men don't like that, but that's the way it has to be. I mean, you know, because I don't like to, to share my bathroom with nobody. <laughs> um... Let me see. Um, I, I'm gonna. And then you want to know, um, do I think that they will marry you? You know, um, if you, you know, move in with them and stay with them. I think if the man really do love you, um, he will marry you. But it's still gonna be like, kind of like up to you. You know, you. You not giving this man everything, you know, not giving him so, so much. And it is going to be hard with you living in the same house, you know, y'all live in the same house together, but it can be done. And um, I'm going to say for the most part, men will marry you. They will. But if it's going to be, if it's taking them like three to four to five years, you might want to think about that. Because um, it usually don't have to take that long to marry nobody. Um, I'm going to say really uh, getting to know someone and the feel of someone. But you can do that in about two and a half years, really. Yeah. You know, especially if you live with them. Um, so I would probably, I wouldn't go what I would try to do, I would try to get engaged before I actually moved in with him. If not, yes, I would um, see if I would move in with them or whatever, see how that works. Because the worst thing you can do is move in with somebody and y'all personality clashes and y'all don't look at everything the same like in the household or you know, he's extremely messy, you know, um, they, you know, men can be messy, but there's some men that can be just filthy, you know, same versus, you know, a, a woman too, and you might not want that for the rest of your life, you know, um, you want to know how they, they do their bills, um, if they're really responsible, if, if they're going to give you that stability that you need while you are there, um, you want to know what they expect from you as well while, you know, y'all living under the same roof. So, I'm going to say, yeah, I would, I would do that before I um, got involved with somebody. I mean, before I married them. But... If you see that two and three and four years is about, no, I'm saying like three to four, three to four years is running around and you are you're not even in, engaged or he's not even discussing marriage with you, um, I think I would move around because more than most likely, he's probably not going to marry you. I mean, watch, I mean, you know, when it gets to that three and four, uh, five years lingering around or whatever, and you still not married, it's, it's like they probably thinking like, why should I, why do I got to marry her? Okay, we've been together this long. That's just the way, you know, men think, but you have, you are letting them think that way. See what I'm saying? Because I would be like, um, okay, this been two and a half years and four months and you haven't even put a ring on my finger. Um, we're not engaged. Um, what are we what are we doing here uh what are your plans with me and um if he can't give you no answer and if you he's not you know trying to marry you he don't say nothing like okay yeah we gotta work on get married or whatever then more than most likely like you know he's not trying to be married um he just probably want to stay with you um and live with you but not want to marry you or something he might not be sure about um 
But remember, a man only is only going to do what you let him do. You know, you have to set them boundaries and and you know let him know what it is even before you even move y'all even move together you need to sit down make your list um of what you want what you will tolerate and what you won't tolerate so i think um uh, that's all i can say about it is um don't get too comfortable as well um just don't do the, the just don't do the wily duties you know just you know don't make him too comfortable you know and let him he, he asks you why then let him know why you're not doing this you're not doing that oh, i do it when i'm married i mean when we get married you know i do all this you know you already know i can cook you know you already know you know of course you want to clean up but you know i can wash and you know whatever but i do all that when we get married you know so I mean, but it is gonna be hard. But I'm saying I am saying I did do it, you know. And I'm gonna say, when all my marriages, we stayed together. Well, I think one was one year, one was two years, and then Rufus was a year. well, we we dated two years, but we lived together one, one year. But um, I got married to you, <laughs> so it can happen. But um, yeah, keep your keep your eyes open, and, and, and you know, and your foot down, and mean what you say, you know, and let him know that, he, that you're not playing. So I hope this helps, and I'm sorry that it took me took me so long. I've been having a lot of things going on, a lot of things going on, but um, so yeah. I will talk to you, everybody, in another video. This is Miss Ruben, all women that are phenomenal. And I'll talk to y'all soon. Bye.